Our universe is huge. Counting the number of stars in it is a tricky job. It is estimated that the universe contain at least one quadrillion stars, which is one followed by 24 zeros, and they come in a variety of shapes and sizes. Some are small but extremely heavy, such as the exotic neutron stars. A teaspoon of which would weigh around a billion tons. While other stars are low mass, much cooler and common throughout the universe, such as red dwarfs. Our Sun is technically classed as a yellow dwarf. Compared to the Earth, Sun is enormous, but on a stellar scale, it is actually fairly average because the universe has produced some truly colossal stars, such as the mighty UI Scuti, which is one of the biggest stars in the universe, stars such as the mass of R13601. The most massive star ever known. R13601 has an estimated mass of 315 solar masses, where a solar mass is equal to the mass of the Sun. But this is just the beginning, the universe contains much more. When UI Scuti was discovered, it was thought to be the biggest one. Located in the constellation Scutum, UI Scuti was originally estimated to be 1700 times larger than the Sun. For many years it was believed to be the largest in the known universe. However now UI Scuti doesn't even make it into the list of top 5. More recent and accurate measurements have found that UI Scuti is more likely to be 775 times the size of the Sun. Still making it a gigantic star, but nowhere near as big as many others that have already been discovered. So UI Scuti is no longer the biggest star in this universe. So which is the largest known star in the universe? Well, that title currently belongs to Stevenson 2-18. An estimated radius of 2150 times the size of the Sun. In fact, if we could replace the Sun with this huge star, then it would easily engulf the orbits of Earth, Mars, Jupiter and even Saturn, which is on average 886 million miles away or 1.4 billion kilometers away. It would take almost 9 hours at the speed of light to take a round around it. The average temperature of Stevenson 2-18 is 3200 Kelvin. It is also among the most luminous cool supergiant stars, with a luminosity of 440,000 solar luminosity. This enormous star is a part of a relatively small cluster called Stevenson 2, which is located around 20,000 light years away. The cluster also contains 26 other confirmed red supergiants, far more than any other known cluster in the universe but none of them seems to be as large as Stevenson 2-18. This newly titled largest star is also very young, around 14 to 20 million years old, and may even continue to grow bigger, possibly one day becoming what is known as a yellow hypergiant. Maybe Stevenson 218 is the biggest star we have discovered till, but as technology advances and we look far deeper in the sky, as our understanding of the universe grows, we may find stars even bigger than Stevenson 2-18. It's just a matter of time.